I sold all of my toys to buy my dream scooter. Well, kind of. Let me explain. This gem right here is a 1988 Yamaha Raz 50cc two-stroke scooter. Clearly, it has seen better days. I have been waiting to get a two-stroke scooter for a long time, but that means I had to take a leap of faith and I had to sell the scooter that has brought this channel the most success. That was a really tough decision to make. On top of that, I sold the red go-kart and the orange Tau Tau scooter and I have the mini Jeep listed on Facebook Marketplace waiting for that thing to sell too. All of this with one goal in mind, to buy my dream scooter, a 1994 to 2001 Honda Elite SR or S, doesn't matter, just a Honda Elite from those years. And oddly enough, that led me to this Yamaha Raz. The reason it led me to this was because it was only $100. <laughs> I did make enough selling the other toys to go buy the scooter that I want, but I live in an area where there is one Honda Elite for sale and even somewhat close to where I live. It is still two and a half hours away. So my plan is to flip this Yamaha Raz to make it worth my time to borrow a truck for five hours to go pick up the scooter that I want. And that's all saying that it doesn't sell before I get the chance to do so. So I'm on a time crunch here. Obviously this scooter needs some things. It needs to get fixed up and it needs to be a lot prettier and actually run. Now I have a hundred bucks into it and I bought some items to fix it up. I figure I have to make about $400 on this scooter to make it worth it. So let's dive into this scooter and see if I can't make it pretty enough and run well enough to sell to somebody. First, I'm gonna clean this thing to make it way easier to work on. Now that it's clean, I'm gonna start disassembling it so I can check out what's wrong with it and clean the carburetor. And also it'll give me a chance to put on the new parts that I got for it. And when I say new, I mean better. Wouldn't it be cool if these were all 10 now? Huh, life is good. Now oh, the seat comes out nice and easy, that's cool. I don't know what comes out first, so I'm just gonna start taking everything out. There's that. Nice bees. It's just come up now. Oh, oh, look at that. Let me guess. Yep. Look at that. Purple power. Oh, something popped. What was that? Oh, okay. Well, there's that. Oh, this thing is just like me. It's full of shit. Do you have to let this stuff sit? Directions. Wear rubber gloves and protect eyes and skin from direct contact. Oh. I still haven't even gotten to the carburetor yet. Where is that thing? Oh, it's right here. Let's get the air box off. This, this is way too slow. I need something better. Ah. Yes. Nice. Look at that carburetor. Look at how baby it is. This looks relatively easy to do. Hey, oh! Um, I didn't think about that. Nope, oh, okay. I need a bucket. Perfect. I'm free! Flowing. Choke. And throttle all in one. Take that out and bang. That actually looks really clean. We might have some good luck here. I think this thing is probably not so bad. I might be speaking way too soon, but let's take it apart. Oh my goodness, it's not that bad. Wow. Okay. 
<laughs> oh my god. Whew, that was almost bad, wasn't it? Uh, that'll work. Nice and clean. So wheat. Tight. Tight. Put this back in. I'm gonna put the battery back on it real quick just to see if I can get it started. Now I'm like curious what happens. Oh, it's okay. Something's happening. Eh. It's ready. It's idling. Let's take a look and see the parts that I got for this thing to make it look better because it already runs. It didn't need anything to run better, it just needed things to be prettier because that whole front kick plate, toast. I don't know what they did, they must have like ran into a tree or something, but we're gonna remove the kick plate, put the new one on, and then the seat. I got a new seat cover, so let's unbox these things and take a look at them and see what they look like. They put so many boxes together to fit this thing. <laughs> look at that. All right, so like I was saying, it's to make this thing look prettier. And I bought one that isn't necessarily perfect. It's missing a piece. So this piece is cooked and gone. The rest of it is all there. So I think this is way better than what's on there now. Look at the entire half of this thing is missing. Look at that. It's gonna be a whole new unit. Now I have to remove all of the previous staples in here, and I don't really know how I'm gonna do that other than like a screwdriver, like a flathead, I guess. Oh my gosh. It's gonna be tedious. I wonder if I can just do this, yeah. Rip the leather out. Maybe this is a bad way of doing it, I don't know. Hey, look at that. Okay. Oh, gross. You know what thought just occurred to me? All of the, the staining on this seat. Potentially ass juice. <laughs> From 36 years of riding. So, just got my hands all up in it. Okay. down so I don't get it all nasty. I think I see how this is gonna work. Let's see if I can get a couple staples to hold. Don't go on my finger. Oh! Oh my god, they're not penetrating. It's just gonna be an ugly staple job. I mean, they're holding and they're pretty firm in there. It's, it's gonna have to be what it's gonna be, I guess. That one worked. Would you look at it? Wow, look at how much better this thing looks. It looks so much better. It is a completely different scooter and it was so much fun to do because it was easy. There wasn't that much going on. And honestly, the seat was the hardest part for me. I think it's time we got to take this thing out for a cruise. I want to ride this thing. I've never ridden a two stroke scooters. I don't think it's going to be very fast, but it'll be fun. It's warm, it's nice. <laughs> it doesn't like full throttle, but I'm thinking that's an issue for not me. Can I wheelie this thing? Oh. <laughs> I 
can't wheelie to save my life. It's light though. Meow. Maximum is 16 miles an hour. 16 miles an hour. That's not good. I just saw a cop up there. seems to be running okay. It's running better the longer it goes. There we go. Now it's revving out. Oh my god. 25? <laughs> yeah, that's a pretty good little machine. It's actually revving out now. This is a long straight. I'm gonna try and hit it and see how fast we can go. I'll go to the end and then come back this way. Here we go. Tucking, tucking for the most speed. We're going uphill. That's the problem. I cannot wheelie. Yep. <laughs> My God, too much. Maximum speed, there we go. 24 miles an hour. Nice. I knocked all the plastics loose. Dragon tail, isn't that a thing that wheelie guys do? I did it. <laughs> I didn't do it well, but I did it. The scooter is sweet, it's fun, but the whole point of this video was to flip this thing. So now it's time to get it posted on Facebook Marketplace and see if we can't sell it as soon as possible. It is fun right now, and if I keep trying to do wheelies on it, I'm just gonna break it, so it's somebody else's toy to break um yeah so let's get some photos of this thing and i'm gonna put it up on facebook here we go all right it's posted to facebook so should be good hopefully it sells quickly yeah until next time see you guys